Technical standards are essential to the modern world. Without technical standards, the physical world we currently live in is inconceivable. Electricity needs to be flowing through technical standards. There's just a million ways that technical standards actually enable the modern world that we live in, the physical world we live in. In a software sense, technical standards are essential for development of the internet. So looking at the websites, every website runs off IP and that's a protocol that everybody knows how to use. Nobody has to think about it. Developers don't have to worry about how it works. It just works, and that's the benefit of technical standards. They enable the infrastructure, both the physical and the software infrastructure of the world, to disappear, allowing people to actually create innovation and create value on top of that. So the TSC is a standards committee that really tries to align and harmonize how we operate in this industry in certain areas. Uh, payments, for example, is, is one of these areas where we can all benefit A from having a predefined standard you can build on and B from then being interoperable with everyone else in the industry that uses the standard. A few examples. Number one I can think of is uh, the wallet support for general smart contracts because right now we are seeing more and more people developing smart contracts at least using S script on, on Bitcoin. But then how do you support arbitrary smart contract for different wallets? If you everybody's doing their own way, it's not very scalable because let's say I have a you know dot wallet support contract and then I have to go to another wallet and they have to customize codes. If we have a standard, for example, it's similar to what MetaMask has been doing, we can have a wallet interface. If we can standardize that, everybody just implement the interface. So once we have a common interface, you know, all the wallet, whoever implement can support arbitrary contract. As I was thinking about being part of the TSC and why standards are important, I went back to a thought from years ago. We sometimes think the world is built on competition, but even in sports competition, it starts in an arena of cooperation because sports teams have to decide that they'll show up at the same arena. They decide that they're gonna play by the same rules. They agree on who the referees will be. So that cooperation is the basis by which standards are made. And within that cooperative environment is where the best competition happens. The standards making process is defining that place that we're going to cooperate and how we will cooperate and in which ways we're going to compete. And that's why standards are so important. So the TSC is really a organization that aims to bring industry together. So one of the critical parts for blockchain being so valuable or one of the critical elements of its value proposition is its interoperability. It breaks down a lot of data silos and it unlocks a lot of opportunities for software to coordinate across industry, across competitors and across um, supply chains. And so in order to do that, there needs to be standards that are well crafted and considerate of all the different needs across industry and the nature of industries is sometimes difficult to have companies collaborate or at least initiate it and work together well. So we sort of try to be the bridge to kind of bring them together, create a platform for them to work together in a fair manner and sort of get the best outcome for all the companies uh, involved. So I think it's important to look at the big picture. Getting involved even in a capacity where you're not necessarily doing the heavy lifting initially but you're having a say and you're being aware of what's going on and you're able to at least plan ahead and think about where you're going can have a big impact on your business. Let's say a standard's going through and it's not relevant to you right now, but it likely will be in a year's time, let's say. Just being mindful of it and helping in a fairly small investment time-wise can lead to significantly improved outcomes down the line. So I think it's very, very wise for businesses to get involved. You don't necessarily have to dive headfirst in just yet, but to be very aware of what's going on and join these work groups is probably very, very wise from a business outcome perspective.